Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. It's your host, uh, Street Urchin. I need a better name. As you may have noticed, got a little bit of a haircut today. Let's try not to dwell on it, even though I'll probably lose half my subscribers. I feel that my coworkers admire me and to be free from rigid rules, yes. What is least important to get things done and see results? When someone offers an opinion or conclusion, I disagree, and I disagree, I am most likely to say something humorous. It's, it's between ask for more information or say something humorous. It, it really, it, it depends. If someone says something overtly retarded, I'll just say something funny. <laughs> But if I think that they're on the right track but not quite there, then I'll, I'll do the Socratic method and I'll ask them more questions so that they can eventually lead themselves to a more accurate answer. Uh, my attitude towards detailed work, de towards detail work like research and data analysis is most often, if it will help other people and make things easier, I'll do it. That doesn't sound like me either. Uh, I would rather have someone else do it. The most accurate way to describe my approach to work is I don't do it. Who will do this with me? Is there anyone I can talk to while I work? There we go. Got it. The things someone could say that would have the most positive impact on me is uh, right, when I hear I really appreciate you uh, that's often a lie so that's not that doesn't you are wow. fantastic once again that's someone trying to boost your uh, your, your self-esteem so I don't believe that you get a lot done I know that's a lie because <laughs> I don't you do excellent work uh, I'll take it Today I thought we'd do a little recap on MBTI and its terminologies. In particular, I'd like to discuss the terms introversion and extroversion. There's still a, a few more people out there on the internet that believe that uh, MBTI uses introversion and extroversion as the uh, standard definitions, which of course is not the case in MBTI. When we're talking about introversion or extroversion, we are describing the cognitive functions themselves, not your overall levels of introversion or extroversion. Most human beings are about 50-50. Typically people People go outside, they go to work, they extrovert for a time, then they come home, maybe read a book, play a game by themselves. So to say that a personality type with a with an I in the beginning of their four-letter acronym is just super introverted and doesn't go out to talk to people, that is stupid. You two and me. Be quiet, Kate. I'm not dead yet, and you're not the queen, you're still my daughter. Your Majesty, you have dementia. Your daughter's been the queen for the past four years. Someone as clever as my father would find a way of taking the rest he needs without letting anyone be the wiser. Are we really gonna keep entertaining this? I've not had time for hunting in years. Many years, at least nine, Your Majesty, you have gout. I'm off to Bannock for some hunting. Your Majesty! No, Tom, it's fine. Just put him in a carriage. We'll wheel him around back to the pond. And not a word to anyone about this little illness of mine. Don't worry, my lord. With the Black Plague spreading through the town, there's really no one to tell. Well, what are you two standing around doing nothing for? There are preparations to be made if you're coming with me. Sire, the only thing we need to prepare is the suit of armor you're going to be buried in. <laughs> no. Father! Edmund, call back the doctor! No need, no need. Ooh, oh, a uh, little bit earlier than I expected. Behave like a dutiful daughter and prepare my comforts for the trip. Princess, I will accompany you. And are you seeing anyone? And as we saw in last week's stream, if we come across a personality type that doesn't have a E at the beginning of the four-letter code, what we're most likely to see is their second function. Taking an ISFJ, for example, their lead function is introverted sensing. So if they're trying to socialize, what function are we most likely to see? <laughs> That's right, extroverted feeling. You know, that, that one function that cares about the feelings of other people. The function that cares about the harmony of the group. Truly amazing how a lot of people don't, don't get that. And that's not to say that ISFJs just love being extroverted around other people. They still want their alone time. They'll go through the automated process of recalling as much about their day as possible, then decide if it's worth it to get up and do it all over again the next day. And as the backbone of society, I hope they continue doing what they're doing. And segueing into another subject, someone asked me if I could type uh, Stephen Colbert. I slapped myself in the face twice hard. The rule is I have to slap myself hard enough that I wish I hadn't. I work hard, but that's not the same thing as discipline. I tend to work hard to throw myself at the times when I've been undisciplined to make up for it. I'm a great making up for it, but that fools me into thinking that, oh, that's a fine way to live. <laughs> My philosophy of life, don't be a dick. Just don't. Now, granted, I'm not as into his comedy, but based on an interview I watched, I would kind of have to go with ENFP, maybe INFP. As per the usual, I kind of need a one-on-one -on -one session to figure that out for sure. His feelings do seem kind of important to him, but as far as I know, he just puts on a show for others. I'd also like to talk about the possible insurgence of uh, introverted sensors getting into MBTI. I, I wouldn't expect a lot of them to be on message boards and arguing with people about how functions work, except for maybe ESTJs and ESFJs, but something similar happens 
happened some decades past. Does everyone remember astrology? When it was the hip thing to do, a lot of introverted censors got to get tattoos, they'd get jewelry, have one of those really silly shirts that say Leo on the front, and I suspect that if it does happen, we'll, we'll, we'll be South Korea in no time. ENFJ, and oh I do my. not like ENFJs. Uh, Please no F. No feelers. If Please you, no T. T guys are the worst to do. I cannot communicate no. with feeler guys. Good. You're a feeler, right? Yes. yes. <laughs> Anyhow, I think that's all there is for today. Thank you once again for your support. Remember to uh, join the Discord and then bother me with whatever questions you want. I'm gonna keep trying out this new way to do videos and see if that catches on. Don't forget about the Saturday streams, and I'll catch you next time. Bye!